versus Paklachan striker Thomas Ramirez against a Goliath. And right now, here comes Don Fry to the octagon. discipline wrestling, Jeff. Well, without a doubt, he has a great wrestling background, having competed at Arizona State University and at Oklahoma State University. But he's also a former pro boxer, which then gives him the added advantage of knowledge on strikes. He's going to say he's not going to go for the takedown right away in our pre-match interview, but I think if he sees an opening, he's going to take him to the ground. And he says he likes to strike when he is on the ground. He is a Tom Selleck look-alike, a state champion, high school wrestling, All-America in Greco-Roman and freestyle. Also trains at Phoenix's First Baptist Church. That's where the Sunkiss Kids Wrestling Club trains. Half the team will be trying out for the Olympics. He is managed by Dan the Beast Sever. And right now his opponent set to make his way to the Octagon, Thomas Ramirez. He is the local product from Bayamon, Puerto Rico. Born in the Bronx, New York, the oldest competitor in the field at age 41, the heaviest at 410 pounds. Undefeated in 200 challenge matches on the islands. Well, Sean is what his discipline is called. Ramirez considers himself a striker, but he has a strange way to strike people. He likes to slam them on the ground. He will hit with open hand strikes. He has no ground experience whatsoever. He's not worried about it. And uh, his stamina is questionable. He, he even admits that uh, he doesn't believe conditioning will be a factor. Our Octagon announcer from Fox Radio in Denver, the G-Man Rich Goins. Buenas noches, damas y caballeros, ladies and gentlemen. SEG Sports Corporation welcomes you to the Galicio Ruben Rodriguez in beautiful San Juan, Puerto Rico. For the greatest martial arts competition in the world, the Ultimate Fight Championship 8. Presenting the super fight you've all been waiting for, Ken Shamrock versus Kimo. Plus the David and Goliath tournament, eight of the world's toughest fighters will walk into the octagon tonight. Four challengers, four giants, only one will emerge victorious. Tonight there are no weight classes, no rounds, no timeouts. Are you ready, San Juan? <laughs> Introducing our first competitor, standing six foot one, weighing in at 206 pounds, a Greco-Roman wrestler with a second degree black belt in the art of judo, over 700 career competition victories, 30-year-old, please welcome from Sierra Vista, Arizona, the Predator Don Fry. Fry. And an expert in the art of Paqua, undefeated in 200 bare-knuckle challenge matches, 41 years old, 6'1", 410 pounds, from Bayamon, Puerto Rico, Thomas Ramirez! Ramirez! Let's get it on! Here's a look at the tail of the tape for this opening bout in the David versus Goliath UFC 8. Hakwachan and Rustling. Ramirez, 11 years older than Fry. The weight 
a huge difference there, almost double his weight, over 200 pounds. And it's the local product, Ramirez, from Bajamón, Puerto Rico, against Donnie Fry from Sierra Vista, Arizona. The octagon at 750 square feet of space, 32 feet across, 5 foot 6 inches padded walls on top of a chain link fence. Two lock gates, tight canvas skin pad, and we are underway. And Fry knocks down Ramirez, and that is it. It's over. Ramirez got knocked into the chain link fence. The he, bout has been stopped by Big John McCarthy. He's still out. His eyes are open, but he's not moving. He looks to be all right. They're just keeping him down for safety. Those were two quick punches that landed to Ramirez's head. Yeah, there's always the danger when the big man hits the canvas hard. Well, his head didn't ricochet off the ground because he came into the fence. But certainly he took...